shipping industry is quite diverse. I mean, um, medium speed trunk piston engines you find in the small shipping vessels and in the biggest cruise ships on this planet. Hence, there are obviously a lot of different challenges. Uh, what is for sure similar to all segments is um, a big focus on cost. And at the same time, they are facing a, a, a storm of, of changes in terms of legislation. So um, recently, the IMO has introduced the has, has confirmed that in 2020 there'll be a, a self cap of 0.5%. Um, but that is just the latest in the wave of changes. The whole Shell, Archina and Gardenia range has always been a very appreciated and high performing series of lubricants. Nevertheless, we talk to OEMs and we talk to our customers and we realise that the next generation of engines will work with higher temperatures, will work with higher pressure and might require a kind of different and new oil. The modern engines have higher brake mean effective pressure, higher maximum combustion pressures and the sums are smaller and on top of that the oil consumption of the engines to reduce emissions is smaller which means that a smaller amount of oil needs to do more work. The development process, uh, of course you can, you can do it quick but maybe it would not be very good. You, you probably need, let's say, one year of Proving ideas, concepts, testing for new components or looking at the chemistries, base oils and the combinations to see how you improve either oxidation stability, thermal stress stability, many different aspects that you can see in single laboratory tests. But one thing that Shell does and is key, is really key and is pretty much unique in the industry, is that we have an engine lab. And with this testing, you really ensure that when you go into the field, you will have a success story. We are very happy that we have a close relationship to a number of customers who trust us so much that they offer their assets for our testing. Besides this, this is obviously done in close relationship with OEMs. With new Argena S5, we're really to create a product which is stronger in these aspects, that consumes alkalinity reserves uh, slower, that prevents fast thickening, and with this we will enable customers to use less oils. The Shell Gardenia S3 has a number of benefits for our customers. First of all, it's a high-performing lubricant who, especially on smaller ships, more or less can be used for all applications on the ship. So it not only reduces complexity and reduces cost, it makes life of the people on board much simpler. At least 300,000 litres of test oil being used. And all this testing has been done not only for the sake of testing, it has been done together with the customers, helping their operation. The customers are already talking about, in some cases, they see how with the new Gadina they consume less oil. So we have one of the trials consuming, I think, in some days up to 20 liters less of oil a day compared to their previous situation. The benefits that customers see of using new Gadina S3 is that they have cleaner engines, they have a lower oil consumption, and because of the application in the gearbox, they have less oils on board. Over the past year, while we've been running field trials, we've seen excellent performance of the new Shell Gardenia in engines operating in marine applications. Particularly, we've been very, very pleased about the performance in terms of lack of control, in terms of engine cleanliness, and in terms of wear performance.